it's getting darker again. And highway. Yes. Oh no. Oh my. back today guys to the channel back here today car x street on the pc once again i've been absolutely loving this game and uh, i've had some comments down below to help me optimize my game that much better but i did forget to put this on last episode this was from usan 26 and he goes is it just me or is there actually too much ghosting effect on the back of the car and we had austin johnson 2162 that's just the anti-aliasing if you change it to smaa it eliminates that effect that's huge i'm excited to test that today because that has been a very annoying feature for people that do play in the third person perspective like myself and of course we don't usually see it until you go quite fast on this game uh, so we're going to need a fast build to pair this up with these new graphic settings here for today huge thanks for coming around let me know your best settings down below and uh, any tweaks that you've made right now a few episodes ago i had a giveaway for the car x street key uh, that is still unclaimed i picked a winner i pinned that uh, if you have yet to uh, see that right claim your key otherwise in about 24 hours i'm gonna have to redo that giveaway so right huge thanks for watching for today let me know your thoughts down below and of course don't forget to slap that like button and uh let's start off today with the most expensive car in the game the uh i don't even know what year this is but we have the asmr advantage for four hundred and fifty thousand dollars. it's a uh, r889 c3 only it's the maximum car that you can buy is a c3 in this game second most expensive vehicle so this is the most expensive car in the game do you agree or disagree with car x's decision on this of course they're gonna probably be adding more cars in but four hundred and fifty thousand dollars down the tubes okay jeez sounds good i think right sounds nice beautiful day here in car x city i don't know what the the city's actually called do we have a name for this city you change it to smaa should take that off he said okay so that's it there so let's leave it on and let's see what this looks like as we're driving first we'll go street tires oh we don't have any street tires okay bye let's see how long a set of uh street tires lasts us for this thing what is happening with that oof car's interesting doesn't really like to slide too much traffic is not knowing what it's doing i <laughs> just like how much there is though it's crazy and I'm not seeing any performance issues with this game, which is nice to see, especially when you do get a lot of traffic like this. Oh yeah, everybody's honking. Oh, Whoa. AI came all crazy there. That was nuts. All right, so we don't notice that back ghosting. Nice, nice. Okay. But once you do start to pick up speed, you start to notice it. Okay, yeah. Find a spot to just a little bit of throttle. Excuse me. Thank you. Oh, that was some crazy air. Do I notice it at all? I don't think so right now. I don't see it at all now. Oh, jeez. Oh no, I see it, I see it now. If you start to pick up speed, you can notice it. It's not as noticeable in the dark, I feel like, than it is in the light. Because I think in the light, you can see it a lot more. Yeah, we need to go to uh, SMAA is what we need to do. And I do have motion blur off. Should I turn motion blur on or off? Let me know in the comments. I'm going to try them both out. Let's just see, but I'm curious. Now, test drive unlimited solar crown launches tomorrow. Um, I'm gonna probably play it. I'm gonna pick it up. Oh. Okay, cool. Yep, yeah, thanks. I'm gonna test it out, see how it is, right? Test drive. I wanna test it out. <laughs> um, but, uh, yeah, I mean, I'm, oh, it's my house. What do you know? Stumbled across on my rides. I love that. Just driving around and there's our garage set up. That yeah, street tire just peels outside here. That's incredible impressive now another thing 
that I wanted to talk about because I just noticed this that uh, I'm sitting here. This was from last episode from Not Trenzoko, and he goes, We need functional traffic lights, in my opinion, other than just blinking yellow light. No wonder the traffic is so crazy all the time. This is it. This, ex this explains it. Everyone's going on yellows. We need some functional traffic lights. That is hands down an update that we need. Two big things that we need. We need brake rotors to light up. Oh yeah, they don't, they don't heat up really. It's 2024. We need brake rotors to start to heat up on these cars. And then of course, traffic lights would be a nice little touch as well too. They're there. They just gotta map them in, I guess, or whatever they need to do. Coming in, coming in. Nice. We gotta get some daylight here. I wanna test these uh, new things though. It does look better though. Like visually it looks nicer. Okay, while we wait for traffic, let's go ahead and dump some cash into this thing and maybe we'll throw it for pinks at the end of the episode. We are 861 horsepower, C6, maxed out basically. These parts are super expensive considering the car is also super expensive. Oh wow, this looks wild. Look at the rear end on there. Kind of like the, the stock lid to be honest. Oh, we can add a spoiler to this too, that's exciting. Black carbon on there, exhaust, oh, that's just the exhaust type. Oh, okay, that's actually kind of, kind of thinking about going this double pipe. Look at the detail though, it closes it. Now we have some fitment issues on the rear we gotta take care of in a second. E, or no, sorry, 60,000 and 71 coins. Goes fast. Oh, it just does half the car. Dark doors, cage. I'm liking my blue cages, if I'm honest, I really am. A Little bit of tuning on the uh, suspension and then we're good to go. We don't need crazy steering angle, but I can't believe I can't drop this anymore. Oh, that rear's dumped on the... Oh! You can change the color. I was like, can you change color on these? And you can. Yeah, look at that. You can add the red buckets if you want. I did not even know that. Yeah, definitely like that one. We can change the color of the backfire. Ooh, that's cool. I'm going green. Damn, I love it. Just right in the shop. Every single time. I love seeing it. We're set. Still in the nighttime. I can't believe this. Oh, look at the green backfire. I did not know. Imagine that. First corner out of the shop. We're going to have some speed now. Oh, man. This thing looks so menacing at night. We are at the top of this, so I'm going to turn it around, I think. Okay, right here. Turn it around here. Oh, what happened there? I didn't touch him. I did there. What is he doing? Move. AIs trip out when they see you. Holy. And they also hit you. Uh, I'm going to quickly, let's see the difference here. I'm going to go back to TAA. Oh, we're flying. So you can see it right there. That's huge. Look at the double glare. Double ghost, whatever. Oh, boy. Can I get back? No. Nope. And now, let's see how it does without it. And also keep in mind, 35% uh, left on our tires. Oh, oh, oh. Jeez. It's actually crazy. Oh, this is insane. Wow. The immersion level is just over 5,000. Okay. Oh. Yeah, I wanted to go off. Run this here. No, 360 in it. <laughs> I meant to. Easy on the throttle. 14% tires left. Ah. 
I was too busy looking at the glare. I don't see any ghosting at all, which is awesome. I was debating about this with the Lamborghini. I'm glad I went with this. Something where we'll drive just to kind of throw around the highway for today. Excuse me, get out the way. Yeah, look at that. And then if we handbrake slide it, let's see what happens. Oh, oh, oh. oh my goodness. Oh, there goes one. Yep. There goes two. We're on that ram. Oh, we're like pitch dark out here. Well, at least we made it to the gas station. <laughs> we're here. We're here. Okay. Two things. Let's go ahead. Fill this up with proper gas. Sport gas. Watch my money drain away. Uh, nitrous. We're full. Still have yet to drive in daylight today. That's crazy. We do have a racing plus on though. Oh yeah, these are grippy. Well, perfect to test our new setting, so. No ghosting. Wow, it looks way better. I can't believe I just hit that. Oh my goodness. Holy jeez. It's gonna be a world record flip. I wanna see what happens when we go this side of the bridge. Cause I know what it looks like on a set -up. Oh no. No way. You can fall off the bridge? This whole line can just, we can just fly off of this thing. Out the way everybody, here we go, yep. Wrong way, but yeah, you get the idea. Holy, it's getting darker again. And highway, yes. Oh no. Oh my. Oh, wow, it turned into a saucer. Glad I fixed the glare. Right, huge thing for the ghost and comment on there. I really do appreciate that. 16 drivers, full lobby. Let's see where they all are. Kind of feeling this one here. Let's see if we can get a bunch of people on this track. 20 grand on the line. Huge bets going down. Oh, wait, what? like that. It's actually kind of quick. What, two laps here? One lap? Damn sprint race. That's tough. That was a good run. Thankfully, that wasn't for pinks. We got some crazy air on that one corner. Oh my God. These guys are by the gas station. Let's see what's going on over here. Whoa, they're drag racing. Hold on, hold on. Whoa, this is sick. I had a rough start on that with traction being on. Let's take that off. Oh, someone flipped. Jeez. So cool to see everybody out here. All their rides. A little nitrous purge before we get to the line. Cars getting left. Did you make that turn nicely, though? Oh, we're getting they okay. Well played, sir. Yeah, we're slow. Definitely got to uh, speed things up a little bit. Definitely a lot of fun today. Um, street tires, though, where it's at for drifting. Race tires where it's at for racing for sure. I like the fact that we can, you know, switch in between these whenever we want to. It's not a, you know, a big hassle. We don't have to go back to the garage and you know, do all that. So 
it is nice in that aspect. I definitely need to work on the tuning a little bit, get these a little bit quicker, and the shifter has got to start shifting better. It's still dropping me into fourth gear. I'm in second gear. I got to figure this out. I got to figure out why it's uh, skipping gears and, you know, miss shifting basically on me because it is definitely annoying to the point where I need to figure out what's happening now because it's just it's too much. Right, it's too consistent with the inconsistencies. Right, so let me know your thoughts down below. Your favorite car on Car X Street at the moment, and uh, maybe I'll build the next episode. Huge thanks for watching. I'll see you guys back in tomorrow. <laughs> Peace.